Hello everybody, so topic for the day is weighted average of price relatives. In my previous video, I have already explained you that index number is of three types, price index number, quantity index number and value index number. Price index number which is denoted by P01, quantity index number which is denoted by Q01 and value index number is denoted by V01. Here 0 indicates the base here and 1 indicates the current year. Now price index number can be calculated or constructed by using two different methods. One is simple uh, method and the other one is weighted method in which we assign weights to different commodities in a group of commodities. Now in the case of the simple method, the uh, method is further classified into two categories, simple aggregative method, simple average of price related method. Uh, till now we have covered simple aggregative method, simple average of price related method and weighted uh, uh, aggregative method in which we have covered seven different methods, last pairs, Pashes, Fishers, Dorbish and Baule, Marshall Edgeworth, Walsh and Kelly. Now today we will be covering weighted average of price relative method. Now what is weighted average of price relative method? In this case weights are assigned based on the relative importance of a commodity within the group of given commodities. Hum एक पर्टिकुलर सेट ऑफ कम्युनिटीज में जो कम्युनिटी ज्यादा इंपॉर्टेंट होती है उसको ज्यादा वेट देते हैं और जो कम्युनिटी कम इंपॉर्टेंट होती है उसे हम कम वेट देते हैं वेटेड एवरेज ऑफ प्राइस रिलेटेड के केस में हम दो मेथड से uh, काम कर सकते हैं आइदर वी कैन यूज अर्थमेटिक मीन और वी कैन यूज जियोमेट्रिक मीन इन द केस ऑफ द अर्थमेटिक मीन द फॉर्मूला इज सिग्मा डब्ल्यू मल्टीप्लाई बाय पी वन बाय पी जीरो इन टू हंड्रेड अपॉन that is denominator denominator is sigma w so the formula is sigma w capital p upon sigma w where capital p stands for price related that is p1 by p0 into 100 that is the price of the current year upon the price of the base year into 100 and w is the weight attached to the price relative and the formula for the weighted geometric mean is anti log of sigma w log p upon sigma w uh, there are two different cases that, that we need to take care of uh, that we need to understand uh, the like first case is if the base year values are taken as weights in other words the our w is p0 multiplied by q0 that is the price of the base year multiplied by the quantity of the base year then the formula automatically becomes sigma w p1 by p0 into 100 upon sigma w here we will replace w by p0 q0 p0 gets cancelled by p0 so in the numerator we have sigma q0 p1 that can also be written as sigma p1 q0 upon sigma p0 q0 into 100 this is what this is last pairs ye uh, last pairs automatically nikal aata hai uh, and in case i am using current year values as as weight so the formula uh, will w will be replaced by price of the base year multiplied by quantity of the current year so the formula will be converted into sigma w p1 by p0 into 100 upon sigma w here w will be replaced by p0 q1 so formula will become sigma p0 q1 multiplied by p1 by p0 into 100 upon sigma p0 q1 here p0 will get cancelled by q0 p0 so in the numerator will be left with sigma p1 q1 upon sigma p0 q1 into 100 so this is what this is Pashe is uh, weighted in aggregative method so uh, this is the thing that you need to take care of now i'll be taking up a question so that you can understand this uh, weighted average of price related method very well so the question is uh, the question is compute the price index by using weighted average of price relatives take the base year price in the quantity for weights using arithmetic mean and the geometric mean so you have been given commodities three commodities uh, are given to you wheat milk eggs and you have been given the price of the base year that is 213 and the quantity of the base year that is 521 and the price of the current year that is 324 Now, uh, the first step that I'll be uh, taking, it has been told to me in the question that take the base year price and the quantity for the weights. So, I need to calculate weights that is W which will be calculated by the base year price and the base year quantity. So, 2 into 5 is 10, 1 into 2 is 2, 3 into 1 is 3. Now, I need to calculate P which is price relative which is equal to P1 by P0 into 100. So, uh, uh, in the very first case P1 is 3, P0 is 2, so 3 by 2 into 100 is 150. Similarly, uh, P1 is 2, 2 divided by 1 into 100 is 200, 4 divided by 3 into 100 is 400 by 3, that is 133.33. Now, 
the wp column will be i will be multiplying 10 into uh, 10 into 150 it will be 1500 200 into 2 that will be 400 and 400 by 3 into 3 it will be 400 again now log p uh, to find the value of log p that is 150 i will use the log table i will look into the column of 15 0 this is 1761 so my figure will be 2.1761 i have written 2 because there are 3 digits in this number so i will deduct 1 out of 3 and i'll get 2 2.1761 2 for 200 again i'll write 2 point and for 133 i will again write 2 point so i will look into 20 uh, 20th row and zero column so i will be getting 0 0.3010 and uh, for this number i'll be looking up into 13th row third column so my value will be 2.1239 now what i'll be doing up i will multiply w into log p this is my log p and this is w so 10 into 2.1761 will be 21.761 and 2 into 2.3010 will be 4.6020 and 3 into 2.1239 will be 6.3717 now the wp sigma wp will be this is your sigma wp it will be equal to 2300 and this sigma w log p will be equal to 32.7347 now the formula for uh, price index number using weighted aggregate arithmetic mean is sigma wp divided by sigma w is equal to the sigma w is 15 so sigma wp is 2300 divided by 15 now my answer will be 153.33 now uh, price index number using weighted geometric mean the formula is sigma w log p upon sigma w so the anti log of basically anti log of this so my answer will be anti log of 32.7347 divided by 15 that is the anti log of 2.1823 so my final answer will be i will look up in the column of and in the table of anti log i will look up in the row of point 18 and the column 2 and the column 3 so my answer will be see this is your anti log table and here this is point 18th row and the column 2 is giving you 1521 and the column 3 is giving you 1 so 1521 plus 1 is 1522 and since this number is 2 i will add 1 into 2 so the answer is 3 so i will putting up a decimal just three places after the first number so my final answer is 152.2 i hope you have understood weighted average of price relative in case in case of any queries you can contact me in google classroom